So here we are at twoedismedica.com, and what I want to do in this video is take you through the changes that we've made in the system so far. So I'm going to come down here um, and go ahead and fill out the registration form here, and it's going to go ahead and fill out a bunch of stuff for me. I'm going to go ahead and adjust it a little bit. And then accept terms and privacy. It will go ahead and refresh the screen, give me a screen that shows me my uh, TEA read my TEA number, and then I can come down here and I'll see the graphic that we have, the information, and then a couple of options here. Uh, one will take me to the Construyente Tierra, and the other will take me to the Benefits page. So here's the Construyente Tierra, and I will go ahead and scroll down, and you'll see we have the uh, we have the different model selection here. I've got one model up right now. It's just a tabbed interface. And um, over here, we've got a slider for the different images and information. Down here we have a couple of buttons. Now the buttons we can either have go to a different page or we could get rid of the buttons, add information to the slider, and then use this area for a description which might be best. Um, these buttons um, bringing up pop-ups are causing a problem so um, these buttons can go to another page that we can pop up in a new uh, in a new tab here if you want. So we can do that so um, just let me know um, exactly how you want to stick and figure that. And then down below here, um, as we scroll down, you'll see we have all the information um, that we already have here um, has, uh, has been copied over from our account. And here I can go ahead and just add in some other information here. And then once again, I do need a list of municipalities. So, and I'm just going to go ahead and put in this postcode for right now. And here is where we could upload documents. And then this will take us to the page to go ahead and make our payment as long as everything validates. And then we've got our information also following over from the account. Here we will go ahead and put in our. Uh, payment information and those are the browser by the way that's just something that Chrome does it's it's very annoying <laughs> I'm going to find a way to stop it. So here we are with our uh, with our confirmation page. Gives us some information here. We can go ahead and uh, we can go ahead and print this. Um, it gives us this graphic up here, billing details, as well as our order number, invoice number that was complete. And here we can go over here, which is the overview for this, and we can see our application has been submitted here, and it can even come in here click over here to go back to the application so that they can come down here and maybe they need to add more documents or stuff whatever and then go ahead and update that and once they update that will take them right back to the page to see the overview and if they want to submit a new application they can click here to actually submit a new application that will go ahead and take them to the page to submit a new application and you see all of this is this empty but this is automatically filled in with their information so um, that's how that works um, the only difference is now with the C portion um, when the person um, when the when the CGA representative um, gives them a um, goes ahead and registers them instead of going to the construi to Tierra page right here it just goes directly to the payment for CGA representatives and then in the email that gets sent over um, when people register for CGA because it goes through a different page and has a different email that gets sent out the email that gets sent out has a link to them uh, so that they can go ahead and come here to this page to go ahead and figure to go ahead and fill out and complete their application um, so they're they're given notification of that that they do need need to, after they paid the CG representative, they do need to come in here and fill out this application and upload their, their documentation here on the site. So anyway, um, if you have any questions, just let us know. Thanks.